Hey, I'm Sexy Phil again. It's DJ Sass United, and I did go to the website. Um, I'm impressed and not impressed. There's not a whole ton of them, actually. It, it's kind of confusing me. <laughs> However, my really, really good friend's brother, whose name I'm not going to list here, obviously, because it's probably illegal, but who lives literally goes that way, that way about like 600 feet, and he's there, is a sex offender. I think I already knew this, but it's still startling to see it. And it also makes me want, I know what he did. Like, I know the situation, and it's not like he's a rapist or anything. And it really makes me think about this website. I know, obviously, see, that that's ridiculous. I'm, that's ridiculous. It really makes me wonder, like, are all these people major sex offenders? Or, see, it's a sex offense against children, rape, sexual battery, and other offense. Around me, it looks like most of them are sex offense uh, against children. And that really really alarms me however I looked more into this and you know this is a very in-depth website if anyone who hasn't gone there who's looking at this reply you can see a map you can zoom in out or out as much as you want you can see a list you can see where they've moved to if they've gone to prison because they have records of like of that stuff in the government because they keep track of that um, but it's really really interesting around me physically there is no one except three people within a 20 25 mile mile radius and then you go away from dc and towards oh, towards actually college park college park maryland which is where university of maryland is has a lot but it's all rape because the the college rape story you know that typical thing that just happens a lot and you know that type of thing um and then once you move towards dc obviously there's obvious reasons why that's gone up but i was very interested in this website and thank you for referring it to me s phil it's dj south united and that's my bit